Welcome and good morning. Thank you for joining us for our Monday's Financial Daily Report, brought to you by iTrader.com. Instead of a major roadblock, the ECB was a significant catalyst for the U.S. dollar, crushing hopes for domestic currency support. Theresa May is heading for a fresh showdown with conservative rebels after they rejected an amendment to the EU withdrawal bill. The staff of the U.S. International Trade Commission claims that Apple infringed at least one of Qualcomm Inc.'s patents. Bitcoin has bounced upwards in the last session, gaining 2.5 percent. The SSI remains stable at 1.3. The dollar-yen pair has gained 0.3 percent in the last session. We see a 2.1 seller-buyer ratio according to the SSI. The price of crude oil has fallen 1.4 percent in the last session. We see a 1.4 buyer-seller ratio according to the SSI. The price of gold has fallen 1.2 percent in the last session. The SSI is showing a 1.63 buyer-seller ratio. The U.S. Fed's William Dudley speech will take place at 1245 GMT. The U.S. NAHB Housing Market Index at 1400 GMT the U.S. three-month bill auction at 1530 GMT, the U.S. six-month bill auction at 1530 GMT, the ECB president's speech at 1730 GMT, and FOMC member Williams' speech at 1945 GMT. Thank you for joining us for Monday's Market Outlook. On behalf of all of us here at iTrader, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to log into iTrader.com for all of your trading needs. Your personal account manager is ready to answer all of your questions.